Turning now to what was a landmark day in the pandemic here in the by state. Well, this morning, the Jennings School District will become the first in our area to bring students back into the classroom. And this comes just one day after the state of Missouri reported its highest single day total of coronavirus cases. We want to get out to our Ryan Henson. He is live at Jennings this morning where those kids will be coming back for summer school. So Ryan, what precautions are they going to be taking to make sure school and, and all the staff stay safe? Well, there's a handful of precautions they're going to be using. And out of any school district in the area, Jennings, they should have the best grasp on things because their superintendent, Dr. Art McCoy, was really the brain trust behind or one of the few people uh, coming up with the key decisions uh, that all county schools are going to have to abide by when they return students back to the classroom. So about 100 Jennings students back in the classroom this later on this morning. Each student will have to fill out an online health screening before coming to class. Obviously, smaller socially distant classes and masks for students 9 and up. Alternating A-B day schedules to avoid unnecessary interaction and large gatherings. Grab and go lunches that will be eaten at desks outside, and a few faculty members even have portable desks. The flexibility has been the most impressive and appreciative thing from our parent group. The flexibility to still have kids come, but also keep them safe with things like this masks, as well as UV temperature checks and online screeners for everyone. And if the plan doesn't work, Jennings is ready for an all virtual fall semester. Jennings is in an interesting position too because many of the zip codes that they serve are also some of those zip codes that we see with those cases surging. I'm Ryan Henson reporting live in Jennings. Send it back to the studio for now. All right. Thank you, Ryan.